What are some good first date questions to get to know someone? What unresolved childhood trauma will emerge through maladaptive behaviors as we spend more time together? What was your first pet's name? What was your second grade teacher's name? What was the make and model of your first car? What is the name of the road you grew up on? What city were you born in? Then read all their emails and DMs. Good way to get to know someone. On our first date my husband and I did a thing where one of us would choose a year G then we'd both say what we were doing in that year of our lives. It was a great way to get to know each other. Do you have any outstanding warrants? Can anyone give an answer on how to get a first date? Let's not put the cart before the horse. OK Cupid had a really cool blog about statistics from their huge user base. The three questions they found were best predictors for compatibility. 1. Do you like scary movies? 2. Have you ever traveled alone in another country? 3. Wouldn't it be fun to chuck it all and live on a sailboat? If you agree on those three, your likeliest to succeed. Edit, because a lot of people are missing this and it's bumming them out. Let me say again, agreeing on these questions correlates with success. Your answers yes or no do not matter, how well they match your partner's answers does. Also, yes, it is just a correlation, not a hard guarantee. There are millions of happy couples that disagree on all three. Some other fun bits from that article. If you want to know if your date is religious, ask how they feel about spelling mistakes. Higher tolerance of spelling mistakes correlates strongly with being religious. If you want to know if your date is DTF, Ask her if she likes beer. There is a strong correlation between the two. Which side were you rooting for in World War II? As you sit over coffee, get beyond the usual nice to meet you, how was traffic, having a good day to get the conversation flowing the next question should always be. So are you aware that you need to put a serious tag on a post if you want to get good answers? Which vegetable offends you the most? If their name is an uncommon one, make sure you ask what's the correct pronunciation. Literally the first thing I said to my husband on our first date was hello followed by a butchered attempt to say his name. He replied what did you just call me? And up until that moment, I had never before felt the urge to jump into the nearby creek in mid-February. Ask them who their favorite Muppet is. If they choose anyone other than Gonzo, explain why they are wrong and then leave. Lots of hypothetical situation questions, I find they help you understand how they think and prioritize their lives. E.g. if you could travel anywhere in the world for W month, all expenses paid, where would you go? What would you do? Favorite Dinosaur your parents are about to be executed. You are given a chance to save only one of them. Which one do you choose? Bonus points if you follow up with what's your favorite ice cream flavor? You got STDS? THX for silver. Do you use Reddit? If they say no, you can safely say something like oh, okay. And change the subject. But if they say yes, then you need to get up and walk away. Edit. My new top Reddit comment is basically a repost https www.reddit.com rask reddit comments 5 by one what is a question that's not too personal but depth for 32 z Context 3 of my own comment on essentially the same question. What do you like doing in your free time? I never asked about people's jobs. I didn't really care how they got their money. I cared how they got their excitement and passion. Have you ever had a dream that, that, um, that you had, uh, that you had too, you could, you do, you went, you wa, you could do so, you do you could, you want, you wanted them to do you so much you could do anything? Why don't you put away your phone? Fun, open-ended questions that lets them talk about them a bit. Stuff like what are your political leanings? Are you religious? 
What is your stance on the Armenian Genocide? What are some good first date questions to get to know someone? Will you marry me? Edit, Classic Schmosby. This isn't so much questions, but a little game you can play that can help break the ice and let you know how well you mesh together. If you're at a place like a bar or a restaurant look around the room and try to come up with backstories for other people there. It can be a lot of fun and takes some of the pressure off, while getting you two talking to each other and getting a feel for each other's sense of humor personality. What's the largest mammal you think you could knock out with a single punch? Why are you gay using Ugandan accent? What are some things our parents don't know about you? Does this look infected? I take it you're trying to date and are nervous? Honestly there is no rule book questions you should really abide to. Just get to talking. Start off with small talk openers like where did you go to school, where do you work, do you like this and that. Eventually you'll get around to talking about hobbies experiences. You can tater off and then talk about your own experiences and just ping pong off of each other. Eventually you get a pretty good feel of that person as genuine or fake. That's how most conversations start sounding natural with a good flow. Of course if you get somebody that sees you, and finds you but ugly, then you won't get any responses at all. And any questions you ask would lead to no information about them. How many walkers have you killed? How many people have you killed? Why? I don't know if it's good for a date but it's fun to ask strangers, what's your favorite compliment? It gives you a lot of information and I think it starts a conversation pretty easily. The irony of all these hilarious answers is that you could probably use literally any of these questions on a first date and they'd most likely laugh which by nature makes them good questions to ask even though they're intended to be bad ones. ITT joke answers are meta AF. I knew this would be a shit show when I didn't see the serious tag lol. What's your name? Who's your daddy? Is he rich? Is he rich? Like me? Coke or Pepsi? Especially if you're serving them. In an emergency how many third graders could you fight off? Just get it off the table. Kids or no kids? Have you heard the tragedy of Darth Plagueis the Wise? What's your favorite random fact? What's the most spontaneous thing you've done? What's your worst cooking disaster? What would be the hardest thing for you to live without? Who do you pick in Mario Kart? From my experience the boring ones picks one of the Mario brothers while the basic ones pick one of the princesses or Yoshi. I like your dress, does it have pockets? What, gives you the right? You ever ducked your dad? Ask about Ford. Family Occupation Recreation Dreams Ask to see a picture of her mum family, she thinks you're getting to know her on a personal level, while you get to see what she will probably look like in the future. Say nothing. Stare into their soul instead. Do you eat ass? License and registration, ma'am? What's your bank account number? My girlfriend and I went through the 3636 questions https www.newyorktimes.com 20150111 fashion 037 big wedding or small .html, on our first few dates, and have been together for the last five years. Can you clarify what cheating means to you? Do you sleep with socks? So. Do you like animes? How good are you at estimating size? Can I see your ID? No joke, if my date seems cool but awkward I've opened up as credit before and had us look for good questions and answer them. It's fun.
Extra fun if there's a question with wild answers that we can look through and laugh together. Ada, and if they don't seem cool I'll ask them what they want done with their body when they die. If they'll pick up that conversational thread we have a future. Beans What's your social security number? What was the name of your first pet? What's your mother's maiden name? 